This is Apple's proprietary USB-A cable, and that's a pair of flush cutters. You guys told me that I should remove the notch. You see, the notch is what makes it proprietary. That means it's only really compatible with the keyboard it was designed for with that matching indentation to go with that notch. Though you can shove regular USB-A cables in there, it's extra hard and takes quite a bit of effort. So the alternative, which a lot of people said that they have done this, is remove the notch. I'm sure there's many different methods of removing the notch. I could crimp it. This is just one of the ways that I thought of. So you can still see where it was, but it's not really a notch anymore. Let's see if I can plug in a cable though, and will it work? Got one of these cheap USB lights. Let's see, press that button there. Oh, no light. What did I do? This light's not working by itself. It's not the cable's fault. I'm punishing you, light. You're not a light anymore. Let's get another one. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't the light's fault. Maybe it was the power bank. Get another try at this. Plug that. Oh, the light works. Thanks. I did it. Subscribe, everyone.